Bro, we were, we were watching Geek Love. Have you guys heard of Geek Love? It's so funny. Hold on. No, no. This is this is funny. Bro, you want to feel like a virgin? Oh, boy. We're going to find a nice girl for you, Ansonator. The Ansonator, he is a superhero EMT Taekwondo beast. I may be a superhero, but I'm so nervous. <laughs> you just know who they are, <laughs> and they're cool with it. <laughs> it's very hard to find someone that actually understands South by Kima. <laughs> Bro, it's the Ansonator. <laughs> <laughs> the Ansonator. Especially. And then when I talked to them about Lord of the Rings, they were like, what kind of rings? Ladies, go to something that was your perfect match right now. So this show is mad funny. Geek Love is my new fucking dirty uh, secret love, whatever you call it. Speed dating in our world. It's a bunch of nerds that speed date. Because at Comic Con, you're in a room with people who are all huge fans of something just like you. So there's that commonality that you can build from. In the outside world, I'm kind of more awkward and it's hard to meet people outside. <laughs> Yo, look up in Captain America. Uh, quote unquote, I think it's free, nine. But here, you can see the real person, the true person. Geek Club. <laughs> Over 18? Yes. Single? Yes. Guys or girls? Girls. The hell are you? <laughs> I am a super EMT, and this is gonna be awesome. <laughs> Bro, it's so unironically cringe. I am the Ansonator. And I it's all real. I'm 24, and I am an awkward geek. No because shit. Because I'm an EMT, I have identifying patches on both sides. This is actually the universal sign for emergency medical services. Oh, because he's and a real EMT. Below, I actually have my superpowers. One of my superpowers is CPR. And one of my other superhero powers is Taekwondo. <laughs> he said, hold on. <laughs> he said, one, two, one. <laughs> Which I do so Still your forms. My superhero <laughs> name is Antinator. It's my nickname, Ant, and Terminator in the Terminator movie. No, it's Antsidator. The things that I'm passionate about are definitely South Park, Lord of the Rings. Oh, Mickey that was Mouse. him with the Kenny oh, suit? Boy, we're going to go to Comic-Con, speed dating, and we're going to have such a good time and find a nice Minnie Mouse. It's hard finding a genuine person. Bro, this is a real person. about similar things that I am. I'm hoping to find someone to actually love me as well as my fandom, which I can share with them, and then we can just be one big happy family. I'm very dude. It's about so that. weird. Obviously, because I've got each and every one of them on my bed. <laughs> oh my God! They killed Kenny. You bastard! The ambulance from Cars. I have tried dating a few people in the fire department, but. It went really, really bad, especially when they found out that I was really into South Park. And then when I talked to them about Lord of the Rings, they Bro, were got like, a South Park figurine of like Stan's Rings? dad on his nuts. Randy on his nuts. So for speed dating... It's actually kind of cool. Girl are you looking for? Girls think that it's actually adorable that I live with my mom. I am a sucker for the block. <laughs> Girls think it's adorable. I live with my mom. Dude, this can't be a real person. Do people really think like that? But yes. that doesn't mean that I'm gonna dismiss all the other ones. I mean, I'm open to all suggestions. The thing I'm open to anything with a heartbeat. At sci-fi speed dating is to find that damsel in distress that I will be her superhero and I will sweep her right off of her feet and then go on an awesome date. <laughs> oh my God, yes. Imposter, he's a comedian. <laughs> You're geek. Don't be in the corner too long. Once in a while, you got a werewolf out. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is the first furry colorized. 1950. Oh, by the way, this is from uh nine years ago. Ladies, wait, and I have not drugged them. Good luck. Sci-fi speed dating. Is definitely going to spice up my my dating life. This is so not what I'm used to. Okay, welcome to Sci-Fi Speed Dating. You're all gonna sit down in the chairs here. Ladies, <laughs> are sit in the bro, you heard that right? He said the ladies are all there, and I have not drugged them. This is my guy. 
stairs facing that wall. Dude, that's. <laughs> Everybody excited? <laughs> you really nervous. Okay, you got nothing to be nervous about. I'm extremely nervous. I may be a superhero, but I'm still nervous. <laughs> I might be a superhero, but I'm still a pussy. The Ansonator. Awesome. He's all costumed <laughs> up, and the costume represents what he is, which is a superhero EMT Taekwondo beast. Good luck. Awesome. I like that guy, awesome. actually. Awesome. The blonde guy's pretty cool. He a just says. Less pelvis thrust. Awesome. Yes. Wait, that's his thing? <laughs> All right, guys, everybody ready? Awesome. Three, two, one, speed date. <laughs> well, I am cosplaying as my own superhero. You're welcome. Yeah. Oh, you pronounced it correctly. Extra points. Yeah. I'm actually a super EMT. If you're trying to look She's like, yeah. What costume was, Dude, that's, that's such a terrible is. first impression. I am an actual superhero. I'm a real EMT, which makes it even better. I'm a real EMT. That's what this is for. I actually saved someone's life and I got an award for it. I took a CPR class. How'd you like it? I took a CPR class, therefore I am also a superhero. I took it mainly because I wanted to use a defibrillator. <laughs> I'm a super EMT. Super EMT? Yeah. I was like, if I call 911 and then you come out like, I am saved because <laughs> Super this is That's so right. weird. My superpowers are CPR and Taekwondo. He is pretty awesome. He made his own superhero. Oh, you here? You know they can see you, right? Yeah, I'm looking for the girl with that spot. But it does matter if uh. she has the same band as me, because well, that'll just make it even more awesome. So. Hi, Jensen. Okay, that's one of my favorites, yeah. but it's not really like up there. My favorite's actually Lord of the Rings. Um, I also love Lord of the Rings. My favorite. By the way, her ears move, and that's Sarah. Gollum. I love Gollum. <laughs> Look at her ears move. Do you like Lord of the Rings? I do. Yeah, no. Um, I like Legolas. Mine is Gollum. Gollum is that's way okay. better. I'm sorry. Do you like Lord of the Rings? Yes, I do like Lord of the Rings. Who's your favorite character? Um, Dude's taking notes on them. Oh, they're taking notes on everybody. Hi, Anthony. Who are you? I'm actually my own superhero. Your own superhero. I'm my own superhero. I'm actually real too. I have a thing for. I'm actually a real superhero. He says this to every chick who runs up on him. I got to hear Sean Astin, Sam from Lord of the Rings talk. Oh my god. That is extra points. High five. Yeah. I was pretty excited. I love. This is speed dating. It was nice you. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. She said precious from Gollum, my favorite character. Oh my god. That was yes. So cool. She does like not sound ecstatic at all. And yeah, it was oh my god. Yes. Right. Ladies, I need you to stand up and go to that table and touch nothing. Gentlemen, stand up, go to that table and touch nothing, and then refocus on me. I'm confident. My number one. Oh, it's the best part. An actual blonde. So they get to see who they matched with, and if anyone wants to talk to them. Who is a huge fan of Lord of the Rings like I am. I doubt. Now, I have ladies, serious I doubts for the part, Ansonator. This is the only time in your life the guys will take longer than you to finish. <laughs> <laughs> That's so they're wrong. Like, like, wait, what? <laughs> My favorite thing is when the guys don't get that joke. What are you talking about? Oh. My number two, she's a speed racer from the Cartoon Network show, The Mach 5. She had a bubbly personality, and I like I don't that. know, man. Now, I need you to get your papers and return to your positions. Go quick. Dude, he's begging for anyone with a pulse to walk over to him. Against your scorecards. If you find someone that you liked, who liked you back, that's a perfect match. We're going to do a little competition here to get a three-minute date with your perfect match, okay? Another three-minute yeah. date. I'm hoping for him. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Why do you keep... <laughs> Stop, that scares the women. Right Why do you keep Go. doing that? Speed is the key here. <laughs> yes, sprints, all of you. It's amazing. Run, make it look impressive. Hurry, girls, hurry. 30 seconds to sit in front of a perfect match. No way. Five seconds. Damn, my dude just got stood up. No one shows him. You wrote your content, you That's so sad. I wonder why. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking L's. Big L's. Please step out now. I appreciate it. I hope you had fun. Look at him. It's tragic. I was hoping that we get to hear my precious. 
one more time, even if it was just for that three minutes. This is the first time I really got to talk to any woman before. Why didn't they like me? Between certain people, and they didn't feel the same way. Kind of maybe knocked it down a few notches. Did he have? No, he had zero perfect matches. You know, he had no bitches. It's frustrating wow. to want to be loved so bad. We all know what it's like when we're alone and we're looking for that. It was like Tay's on day. Frustrating. The poor guy's got to be feeling it. <laughs> zero riz. I definitely feel a little discouraged, but at the same time, it's the same thing about when I fight, when I fight super villains, when I can't succeed once, I just keep going again. You don't fight super villains. You save lives. You know, I hope Anthony takes the opportunity you... to the girls that did like him. I hope he gives him a call. He's got a built-in second chance there. Why are you guys there. standing like that? And Which he, one? He just needs <laughs> more back. than three minutes. <laughs> Wait, why? I know why. Right there. Him? The guy with the he's orange? Like this. this guy? <laughs> no. You know, the I guy, hope Anthony the takes the that. opportunity with They're the girls that did like him. On. Can't succeed once. I just no. keep going again. Let it, go. Let it keep going. He's, a, he's eventually going to... That guy. Him? The green vest. Yeah, wash him. <laughs> You know, I hope he Anthony takes stupid. the opportunity with the girl who didn't like him. <laughs> I hope he gives him a call. He's like, oh my god, it's the, it's the Ansonator. It's the Ansonator. My arch rival, the, <laughs> the Ansonator. Yes, yeah, so he got no bitches. So I didn't get a perfect match. And no, he believes he's a superhero. But with his fucking Nissan Maxima. A few numbers. And one girl loves South Park as much as I did. Her name is Sarah, and oh. on our first date, we actually spent the entire time going back. Oh, he went to a. He actually went on a date with someone after. It was really fun. It feels amazing to actually meet someone yeah. they can share an intellectual connection with, especially about South Park and motor learning, which are my two favorite things. Wait, what did I say? What? Really help me my self what did I do? So, I'm glad that I did it. <laughs> Who knows what the future could hold? Maybe girlfriend, maybe even more. Wait. He said maybe girlfriend, maybe even more. Is he talking about the sex? He can't have the sex. 